And tonight, we are learning more about the coronavirus's impact on the heart. Romney Smith explains why COVID-19 patients have a much higher incidence of cardiovascular issues. A trip to the hospital could be needed if you have coronavirus symptoms like a fever, shortness of breath, and a cough. But Dr. Mehdi Shishibor, the director of the Cardiovascular Interventional Center at University Hospitals, says there is overlap with signs of a heart attack. People can have chest pain with both condition. People can have shortness of breath with both condition. Cardiologists think COVID-19 is putting coronavirus patients at a higher risk for heart issues. Well, we are learning more and more that COVID-19 can actually increase increase the likelihood of blood clots in the body. That's what happened to Broadway star Nick Cordero. He thought he had the flu and later learned he has coronavirus. He recently had to have his right leg amputated because of blood clotting. In his situation, he was so sick that he was also on a heart-lung bypass machine. As Nick's wife prays for his full recovery, Dr. Chishabor tells me the more patients are diagnosed, the more doctors are learning how much the coronavirus impacts blood clotting in small arteries. Uh, affecting, the, let's say, the brain, the kidney, or the heart, as we discussed earlier, or it can affect the large veins and the arteries in the body, for example, causing a pulmonary embolism or causing a blood clot in the leg. Dr. Shishabor says 10 to 15 percent of coronavirus patients present with cardiac symptoms and don't have a fever or a cough. If you're concerned about heart health and the coronavirus, you're advised to call your doctor. Romney Smith, 3 News.